Week 1 covers chapter 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, and chapter 8. This is more than one per day, in addition to beginning the prep sheets and watching a couple of videos from the VOD page. That is so much. Essentially, this week our focus is on pregnancy. Chapters 13 to 17 cover various aspects of this, and chapter 8 covers sexually transmitted infections, which we look at in reference to pregnancy. If you read them and collaboratively do the study guide questions, you will have mastered what you need to know for this section. Chapters 13 and 14 are basic foundational material. 13 is concerned with conception and introduces some key concepts like how the fetus is oxygenated that turn out to be really important later. Chapter 14 gives OB specific information. Everything else in this class will be easier if you master this chapter well. There are 50 study guide questions, more than any other chapter. Still, if you divide them up between 10 to 30 of you, it shouldn't be too bad. Chapter 15 is about nutrition and pregnancy. This subject shows up on the HESI and the NCLEX. Chapter 16 is more complex than any of the others this week. Here is a clue. All the chapters that begin with nursing care of are things you need to know. Chapter 17 is a little bit of a breeze compared with the others. If you read my introduction and scan the chapter, you will probably know what you need to know. There are only two questions in the study guide for Chapter 17. They will not be posted and they're just a knowledge check for you.